Again, you should still have the vacation.psd file open on your screen. And in the previous exercise, we learned about the toolbox and how to select different tools. On the right hand side of your screen, remember these boxes are called palettes. And usually when you turn on the computer and open up Photoshop, you should see three or four different palettes here. Okay. Now, these palettes can be moved around to new locations if they're in your way. And also, you can close the palettes to get rid of them because they take up so much room, sometimes they block too much of the work area and people choose to get rid of them. Okay, But um, if the palettes are gone, and you want them back, you can just go up to Window, and you can see that you can show or hide different palettes. So, for example, if I want the Navigator palette to show back onto the work area, I click Show Navigator. If I want the Color palette, I click Show Color. If I want the History palette, click Show History. And if I want the Layers palette, click Show Layers. Now. These palettes also have different tabs that group different functions together. So for example, this here is currently the color palette. But if you click the swatches tab, that switches the color palette to a swatch palette. Okay, So the swatch palette is now active. If I go up to Window and I go down to Hide Swatches, you'll notice that that palette has disappeared. Okay, And if I go up to Window and I go Show Swatches, that makes that Swatches palette reappear. Okay, So again, by clicking different tabs within a palette, we can switch between different palettes that are grouped together. Okay.